Welcome to Chapter 2 of our gripping tale. The scene unfolds in a corporate boardroom, where the sterile environment stands in stark contrast to the chaotic creativity of the lab. It's 10.15 a.m. on a dreary Tuesday, and the fog outside clings to the glass walls like a shroud. Cleo Gadget's son, our determined detective, stands at the entrance, feeling the weight of the case pressing down on her. The air is thick with tension, punctuated by the soft hum of fluorescent lights overhead. Victor Steele, a man of corporate stature, confronts Cleo with a booming voice, reminding her of his authority. But Cleo is undeterred. She needs answers about the encrypted messages found on the victim's computer. Steele's smirk suggests he knows more than he's letting on. Cleo recalls his interactions with the victim, a mix of admiration and envy. As the boardroom door swings open, Maya Lin enters, her petite frame a stark contrast to the imposing figures of the executives. She brings urgent news. The prototype is missing. This could be the key to unraveling the corporate espionage. Cleo's pulse quickens as she prepares to search the premises, determined to uncover the truth despite the anonymous warning to stop the investigation. The stakes are rising, and Cleo is not about to back down. As the investigation progresses, Cleo Gadget's son finds herself navigating the intricate web of corporate espionage. The boardroom, with its sterile environment, becomes a battleground for truth. The encrypted messages on the victim's computer are a puzzle she must solve. Cleo's mind races with possibilities, each deduction bringing her closer to the truth. The missing prototype looms large in her thoughts, a critical piece of evidence that could unravel the entire case. The professional dynamics in the room are tense, with Victor Steele's smirk hinting at secrets yet to be uncovered. Outside, the fog thickens, mirroring the murky waters of the investigation. Maya Lin's urgent whispers add to the atmosphere, her discovery of the missing prototype a breakthrough moment. Cleo's determination is palpable, her resolve unshaken by the anonymous threats. She knows the stakes are high, but her commitment to justice drives her forward. The tension in the room is almost tangible, each moment bringing new revelations and deeper mysteries. Cleo's deductions are methodical, her investigative skills sharp as she pieces together the clues. The fog outside may obscure the view, but Cleo's vision remains clear. She will uncover the truth, no matter the cost. In the final moments of this chapter, Cleo Gadgetson's investigation reaches a critical juncture. The corporate boardroom, with its foggy setting, becomes the backdrop for a series of tense interactions. Cleo's detective procedures are meticulous, each step carefully planned as she navigates the complexities of the case. The discovery of the missing prototype is a pivotal moment, a piece of critical evidence that could change everything. Cleo's professional role as a detective is evident in her every move, her behavioral traits marked by determination and resolve. The investigation tools at her disposal are put to good use, each one helping to piece together the puzzle. The tension in the room is palpable, with every interaction charged with the potential for revelation. Cleo's determination is unwavering, her focus on uncovering the truth unshakable. As the chapter draws to a close, the fog outside mirrors the uncertainty of the case, but Cleo's vision remains clear. She is a detective on a mission, and nothing will stand in her way. Join us next time on the Storyteller channel as we continue to unravel the mysteries of this gripping tale.